presence of God, Father, Son, and Holy Spirit, we have come together to witness the marriage of Eve and Jason, to pray for God's blessing on them, to share their joy, and to celebrate their love. Marriage is a gift of God in creation, through which husband and wife may know the grace of God. A good marriage must be created. In a marriage, the little things are the big things. It's never being too old to hold hands. It's remembering to say I love you at least once each day. It's never going to sleep angry. It's having a mutual sense of values and objectives. It's standing together and facing the world. It's forming a circle of love that gathers in the whole family and it's speaking words of appreciation and demonstrating gratitude in thoughtful ways. It's having the capacity to forgive and forget. It's giving each other an atmosphere in which each person can grow. It's not only marrying the right person, it's being the right partner. In the presence of God and before this congregation, Eve and Jason have given their consent and made their marriage vows to each other. They have declared their marriage by the joining of hands and by the giving and receiving of rings. I therefore proclaim that they are husband and wife. Those whom God has joined together let no man put asunder. Spontaneous round of applause, and they kiss the bride. My wife, I didn't do too bad. Your dress looks incredible, only overshadowed by how beautiful you are. I want to thank you for everything you have done to make this day possible. Not only did you make it happen with all of the complications, you did it while also having to deal with me. It didn't take us very long to realize we were meant to be together, and it didn't take me much longer than that to realize I should be saving for a ring. You are the kindest and most beautiful person, and I can't begin to explain how lucky I feel to call you my wife. I love you in so many ways and for so many reasons, but mostly because you're the one I can't live without.